Am I audible as a cat as well? Making it to the launch of Aditi Mathur Kumar's book, Soldier and Spice and Army Wife's Life. I'm sorry, can I request you get seated or move to the sidelines, please? Met Mera. At 26, Pia finds herself having to suddenly be high tea and welfare function and deal with long unexpected separation from her husband, extraordinary challenges, a little heartache and well, growing up. Can, can people at the back see what's going on? I, I think I'll have to request just for to push on a little to the sidelines. Since then, since then, it has been. Before we go on to a conversation with... 
Yes, both of you here. Yeah? Yes, both of you here. Yes, both Yes, both of you, ma'am, here. 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 Yes, good, ma'am, here. Ma'am, here one last. Yes, both of you center, one more. Thank you, Good ma'am, good ma'am, good ma'am. 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 Aditi ji, good ma'am. Center ke andar. Ma'am, yaha pe. This way. Okay, we look here. So we look here. We will shift. Yeah. So right first and left. Ma'am, center. Yeah. Both of you, ma'am. Please one more. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's heartbreaking, but Nana has noticed that generally only the CEO and commander's wives get lucky and win prizes. Also. When in doubt, wear a sari to all 4G functions. A few senior ladies are very particular about dress code and defying it will be seen as bad behavior. Also, of course, which uh, Aditi just addressed, always wish the senior ladies. It's like going to school and having to wish the teacher. Never pretend not to see them. They notice everything. This actually happened to one of my friends who was in the... I'm a canteen. My life was before I married. I was somebody who, very casual, okay? I was somebody who would air kiss and hug people. And in army, the moment you're married, you'll say, good evening, Mrs. So-and-so. And I used to, in the beginning, I used to have such a huge problem remembering their surnames because I wouldn't know their husbands, right? And I would, I would just say, good evening, just mumble something so that they know. And I would then later ask my husband, who was that? Then he'd say, good evening, ma'am, work? Ma'am, no, because ma'am is what officers, uh, or the the lady officers, they call them ma'am. So, so uh, the lady, a lady officer would call me ma'am, but I would just address Mrs. So-and-so. But yeah, there are incredibly cool wives also, like Manali insists on me on calling her Manali. She's a... <laughs> yeah. Saris, oh my... That's Adali, I'm just wondering, how many saris did you have before marriage? Three. That's also borrowed from my mother, I guess. Who wears saris? I have another question. I was seeing some pictures uh, recently. My, I'm, both sets of my family uh, are forgies, so my in-laws are also forgies. So I was seeing some pictures of my in-laws having gone for a reunion re recently with the present and the retired officers, and a lot of the younger ladies were in dresses, and I thought that was blasphemous. Really? Yeah, and I asked my father to go join that group. <laughs> guards, by the way. Guards, are, uh, as my father knows, yeah, is cooler. Yeah. Yeah, but cooler. Um, apparently, I asked my mother not three times. I said, are they like wives or are they guests or are they daughters? She said, no, they are youngsters' wives and they were wearing dresses to morning functions. So cool because uh, in I am we're from artillery. And I've never seen anybody wear a dress. Very One time I saw, you know, I must tell you. This socialization of what is right and what is wrong is so ingrained in us as 4G kids. Uh, many, many, many years ago, as a six-year-old kid, I was attending a hundred sequicentennial celebrations of one of my father's units with my dad. And uh, fortunately, the battalion was very kind. They invited all the kids. So there were kids running around, doing their own thing. And there was a CEO's wife who was wearing a dress. And do you know how all the kids reacted? Oh, wow, auntie, the dress penny here. All the kids. I mean, forget the, what the other ladies must have been talking about it. But as kids, because even in our uh, psychology and in our brain, the fact that women and ladies are supposed to dress a particular way in the army is so ingrained that all of us kids at five to seven were gossiping about auntie wearing a dress. Oh, this is exactly what we said. So our brains are equally being like, Brainwashed.